hello friends welcome to learning digitech and today we will see another type of topology known as tree topology so okay friends let's start tree topology a tree topology is a special type of structure where many connected elements are arranged like a branch of a tree It is also known as hierarchical topology. The topology divides the network into multiple levels of layers network. Mainly in layers, a network is bifurcated into three types of different devices. Have a diagram. Now in this, the lowermost. the lower most is a access layer where the computers are attached these are attached computer and this is the lower mode it is known as access layer now after that there is a middle layer is known as distribution layer which works as a intermediate between the upper layer and the lower layer and the higher layer is known as the core layer and is a center point of a network that is the root of the tree from which all nodes forks a tree topology combines characteristics of linear bus and a star topology that's why in computer network we also called it as star bus topology it incorporates elements of both let's have a diagram this is the one bus and not good enough in diagrams these are the nodes connected to the bus backbone this is the bus cable these are the nodes or a computer that are connected to each node which are going to be the bus now this is a example of a tree topology in which these are the starboard work stations and which is connected to a bus backbone so we can say that it consists of a group of star configured work station connected to a linear bus backbone okay now tree topologies allow for the expansions of an existing network and enables schools or colleges or organization to configure network to meet their needs okay now have a look at the advantages of tree topology Tables of leaf node can accommodate more nodes in the hierarchical chain. A point-to-point -point wiring to a central hub and each intermediate node of a tree topology represents represents a node to the bus topology. Other hierarchical networks are not affected if one of them get damaged. and easier maintenance and fault finding these are the advantages of tree topology now have a look on decent advantages huge cabling is needed a lot of maintenance is needed and if the central cable or the backbone somehow gets fail or faulted it's the point of failure the whole tree, uh, tree topology will collapse Okay friends thank you for watching this video if you like my video please press like button we will discuss much more about computer networks in the next video so please subscribe my channel thank you